Okay, so this video is about how to create a pivot table. So let's say that you have a series of, uh, you know, true classifications. So in the data set that we've been working with, we've got the actual truth of whether we played or not. And then we have our prediction of whether we played or not. And then we have just sort of a simple count to make some of the bookkeeping easier. If you're starting from this place, then to make a pivot table is pretty straightforward. First, you wanna select the data. So click anywhere in that table and hit Control A or Command A if you're on a Mac. Click on Insert and click Pivot Table. It'll automatically detect what table or range you wanna pull the data from. So that should already be populated correctly. Just to make it simple for this, um, we're going to put it in cell AD1, um, but you could have it place it into a new worksheet if that was helpful. Click on the existing uh, worksheet, pick AD1 in this example, and click OK. What you're going to see is just sort of an empty pivot table because it doesn't know what you want to see. For the purposes of our work, to evaluate our uh, classification accuracy and so on, we're gonna want to arrange the pivot table like so. So we take our count, put it into values. Then we change the value field settings from sum to count, uh, just you know, to keep it consistent. In this case, it's gonna be the same number, but you know, who knows? And then we take the accurate classifications, the true classifications, and we put them in the columns. And then we take our predictions for those classes and we put them in the rows. Once you have this, you pretty much have everything that you need to evaluate accuracy and recall and precision and get a sense of how good our predictions are.